Like, this is tiny. <sighs> Fucking hell, it's hot. Because I don't want my whole guts to be on show, you know what I mean? Ew, but dry skin, how nice. I hope it hasn't been there the whole time. Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So, as you can tell from the title, in today's video, I'm going to be doing a huge collective haul. So, I've been doing so much shopping recently online because obviously there's been a lot of sales, um, a lot of discounts going on. So, yeah, my bank balance has not been that happy, but I've got some really, really cool pieces to show you. So, these pieces are going to be from mostly in the style, but I have also got some Opoly, I saw it first, and pretty little thing items as well. So, this is probably like the biggest haul. I've ever ever done on my channel I have so much stuff to show you so I'm not even going to talk too much I'm just literally gonna go through them all obviously I'm going to try everything on there's going to be try on clips as well so I'm going to start off with the I saw it first stuff because this is probably the store that I got the most stuff from I think I ended up spending around a hundred pounds but I did get so much stuff and all of it was in the sale so hopefully it's still available when this video goes up if it is I'll just link everything in the description box below also I've got a bit of a sore throat so if I sound a bit manly that would be why from I saw it first I wanted to pick up some like kind of like basic items because I realized that recently I've been buying a lot of stuff that is kind of like a little bit more dressy or a little bit more out there but then I realized that I am kind of lacking in my more like basic clothes department in my wardrobe so I wanted to pick up some more casual basic items so the first thing that I saw on the website is this t-shirt so as you can see it's kind of like a graphic tee it's got like a tiger on it and what does it even say it says world and free reckless which I mean, I didn't actually know that it said that before I just read it just then, but I really, really like the style of this. Obviously, as you can see, it's kind of like an oversized style. This is also quite a long t-shirt as well, which I actually really like because it goes just past my bum, which is perfect for if you want to wear like those really thin leggings. And you know, like when you wear those, you want your bum to be covered because they're a little bit too revealing there. So I really like the length of this as well. It's like a perfect sort of length. And yeah, I believe this one was six pounds. So really super inexpensive. I just wanted some basic t-shirts that I could wear with jeans, with leggings, with whatever and I really really like that one. I have already worn that a few times as well. I did also pick up the same exact t-shirt in white because like I said I really enjoy the kind of print on the front of this. I think it looks really really cute and yeah I just wanted to get the exact same one in white because I couldn't decide on the colours. I think as I said they were both £6. These actually feel really good quality as well like they don't feel too thin. This one it doesn't look like it's going to be see-through either because obviously like white stuff can look normally be see-through but yeah I just thought I'd pick this one up in the white as well because I feel like I'm going to get so much wear out of these in the summer oh, my back is literally aching I've not got like a backrest I'm just like sitting on the end of my bed the next thing that I picked up was another basic item and this is just a plain grey t-shirt this one has kind of got like a v-neck and the little rolled sleeves again I just wanted to pick up some basics to just wear with jeans and leggings so this one is just a little bit more of a plainer version more of a plain Jane t-shirt than the other two but yeah again I think this one was around the six pounds mark and it does feel really nice quality and what I like about this is because I have actually worn this one a few times as well is it's not that t-shirt material where it creases it's that kind of like stretchy material so you could literally like throw this in a bag and when you get it out again it's not going to be all creased up and disgusting so I actually really really like the material of these t-shirts I'm really quite impressed just sticking with the plain t-shirt theme I think this is the last one so sorry to bore you with all these basics we are going to get a little bit more fancy in a minute but this one is just this cream kind of camel colored with a what is this called leopard print kind of like trimming on the neckline and on the arms again I just thought this would be perfect just with jeans and I as I said I really needed to stock up on my basics so again I think that was around maybe even five pounds or four pounds I think this one was a little bit cheaper and again it feels really nice quality it's that kind of stretchy material this one does crease a little bit more I've noticed but yeah still feels really thick and like heavy and good quality this one this next piece that I picked up I actually really really love and it's not something that I would ever usually go for but this is a cow neck bodysuit in this really kind of like neon it's kind of like a lime green it looks probably more yellow um on camera but it's actually more of like a lime green color i wore this on a night out um i'll put the picture on the screen now um, i wore this on a night out with some ripped top shop jeans and some white heels and it just looked so nice and i really like the color for summer like i just feel like in summer i want to wear a little bit more bright 
like colors and yeah i just thought this was really really cute i love cow neck style stuff anything with a cow neck i absolutely love it body suits dresses tops whatever i just think that they really flatter my chest because i've not got the biggest boobs it kind of just sits in a way where it makes my boobs look a little bit bigger so yeah i really really love this again it's that kind of stretchy material so this one is a little bit thinner but where is the cow neck it doesn't really matter because obviously you've got that extra bit of fabric anyway i didn't wear a bra when i wore this i just let them you know go free and yeah i felt really secure it does have the popper bottom as well so when you need to go to the toilet you can just undo the popper as opposed to taking the whole thing off so yeah i really really love this and i really like the color as well i think it's something just a little bit different from what i usually go for so as i said i love everything cow neck so i did actually pick up the exact same bodysuit but this one is in like a light pink color i thought this one was a little bit more casual and a little bit more wearable than the green one the green one i would only really wear on kind of like nights out whereas this one i'd probably wear to sort of like more dinner and things like that like a little bit more casual but yeah, I just really, really like the style of these and I just can't have enough bodysuits. Bodysuits are literally like pretty much what I live in. So yeah, got another one of those. Those were about seven or nine pounds, something like that. So moving on to some trousers for a second because I'm even getting bored of doing the tops. I picked up these faux, these are going to be hard to sort of show on camera, but I'll try them on. These are kind of like, I don't know how to describe this material. They're kind of faux leather, but they've got like patches of faux leather and then they're just kind of normal material if that makes any sort of sense but these are some sort of paper bag waist trousers they kind of come down a little bit more skinny towards the ankle but then they have got the belt at the top as well i just thought these would look really really nice on kind of like a night out or like dinner or something a little bit more fancy where you don't want to wear jeans but you don't want to wear a dress at the same time i just thought these would look really cute with like a bodysuit or like a little black cami or something like that so i really really like these i picked these up in a size eight. Oh, i haven't been saying the sizes I've picked up pretty much everything in either a 6 or an 8. Tops I usually do a 6 and then bottoms I usually do an 8 just as like just so that you guys get a little gauge. But yeah these fit really really nicely and they feel really good quality actually as well. So the next thing that I picked up again it's a little bit of a sort of out there colour for me. I don't usually go for this kind of colour but I wanted to choose some items that I don't really have anything similar to in my wardrobe because I constantly buy things that I have like already like 5 of in my wardrobe. So I picked up this little top. This is kind of like a crop top it's got long sleeves with a little like bell sleeve at the end and this one will tie in the middle obviously here it doesn't really look like much but you'll see it on the try on clip it kind of ties in the middle you can tie it in like a little bow and you can tie it as kind of tight or as loose as you want and I feel like these sort of tops again are really flattering on my body shape because they make my boobs look quite nice because I can tie them quite tight and then make my boobs you know stand up a little bit so again I thought these would look really really cute with like jeans um, or like denim shorts in the summer i would probably wear this one a little bit more casually or you could wear it on a night out but um yeah because it's got the long sleeves i'd probably wear this a little bit more casually but i just really like the color of this it's obviously kind of like a mustard yellow color and i just thought again really really nice for summer probably wouldn't wear this much in the sort of like winter time but really really nice for summer and right, the next thing i got is actually very similar to the last item that i just showed but this one is a red version and this one has got short sleeves so it's the same concept it's kind of like a tight in the middle detail top this one has short sleeves though so it's a little bit different from the other one i just really really like tops like this that you can just throw on with a pair of jeans and they look really cute for like kind of anything really i would wear these casually and i'd wear these more dressy as well um it depends what kind of shoes you're wearing you could put heels on or you could put like trainers on but yeah i really really like these little tops um these ones do crease quite easily which is annoying but yeah i think this was only about four pounds so can't really complain love that one my back is literally in bits the next thing that i got was this little black crop top i didn't realize this was going to be as see-through as it is when it arrived it didn't look like it was going to be see-through on the model but when it arrived it is literally just this sheer completely sheer lace kind of crop top material it has got like a thick black band at the bottom which isn't see-through and then it does have these tie sort of i don't really know how to do this i feel like I haven't tried this one on yet so I'm gonna sort of like try something out in a try on clip but I guess you kind of tie it around and then possibly bring it to the front and tie it in a bow I'm not too sure but yeah I don't really know about this one because it's just completely see-through so I'm gonna have to wear kind of like some like nipple daisies underneath it because I'm not about to get my nips out but um, I don't really like tops where I have to do that because then I have to think about it more and I'd rather just chuck it on it is still cute again it would look really cute with some jeans or even some black leather pants as well this would look really really nice with one more item from I saw it first 
first and then we're going to move on. So this last item from I Saw It First is just literally the exact same as the red crop top that I just showed you, but this one is in black. So this is just a black version of the short sleeved Typhron crop top. I just get so much wear out of these like kind of little tops. So I just thought I'd pick it up in a black as well as a red. The black is obviously a little bit more casual. So just thought I'd get that in another colour and I really, really like it. Oh, there's so much shit on my floor. If you could see my floor right now, my room looks tidy, but it's not. It's not. So the next place that I ordered from was In The Style. From In The Style, I literally just ordered jeans because I'm obsessed with jeans at the moment. I don't know why I feel the need to buy so many pairs of jeans. But anyway, I went on there and I had a little bit of a sale going on. So I picked up some jeans. Oh, I can get them out. Oh my God. So I picked up all of these three pairs of jeans from In The Style in a size six because on the website it had a kind of like sizing guide and it said that the size six was a 25 waist. I'm like a 24 waist, but 25 is literally perfect because it gives me a little bit of room. So I picked up all of the jeans in a size six, but they actually, some of them fit really weird. And I am gonna be sending two of the pairs out of the three that I got back because they just don't look right on me and I just wouldn't really wear them. So the first pair that I got is this, obviously this light wash denim. This one one has like a come with it come with it this one has a sort of attached belt that comes with it these aren't ripped or anything so they're just like normal straight leg jeans and they just have a little sort of frayed bottom but these aren't as high-waisted as I would want them to be I like my jeans to be like super high-waisted because I really want them to kind of pull my stomach area in I'm not the biggest person in the world but I do have a little bit of a stomach you know like I have a little bit of a food baby quite often I bloat really easily so I don't like jeans that kind of cut me off halfway through my tummy area because then I kind of get that little you know like that little bulge at the top it's really unattractive so these just don't fit me the way I wanted them to I'll show you in the try on clip so these are going to be going back but if you don't mind your jeans being a little bit lower rise these are actually really really nice and they feel really good quality as well just not for me unfortunately I feel like I've got something on my lip feel a bit dry skin how nice I hope it hasn't been there the whole time so this next pair of jeans, I actually really wanted these to work and they just don't on me. These are this light wash denim ripped jeans. Again, I got these in a size six and they fit me perfectly around the waist. But these are just so long. Like literally they're just so long and they have this such frayed bottom of the jean that you can't even really roll these up because usually on me, I would just roll the jeans up at the bottom. But this style of jean, you couldn't really... You can't really roll that up, to be honest. And these are just so, so long on me. They just make my legs look really, really short and just cut me off at a weird place. I'm about five foot six, I think. Five, 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 six, something like that. I'm not like the tallest person, but I'm not the shortest person either. And these are just super, super long on me. I feel like these were made for someone that was like five, ten at least. So these will be going back because they're just a little bit too long. But again, they feel really, really nice quality. So if you are a little bit taller, these would probably look really, really amazing on you. But just on me, they just don't work unfortunately this next pair of jeans though from in the style i actually love and i will be keeping these are like my favorite pair that i got from them obviously these are a pair of black ripped jeans so they have rips kind of going all the way down the front and these ones are super super high waisted which is what i absolutely love and look for in a pair of jeans these ones feel that kind of thinner denim um as opposed to the other ones they're like that proper like thick proper denim but these ones are a little bit thinner i don't mind that though because like during the summer you don't really want something that's thick heavy denim like this material is kind of perfect for like more summer and yeah i just really really like the way these fit i will show you in the try on clips these would look really really nice with those crop tops that i just showed um and i don't i only actually have one pair of black jeans and they are like a really like distressed kind of washed out black so these are the only pair of like full-on just jet black jeans that i own so i feel like i actually do really need these in my wardrobe like they will be a really good addition yeah i really really like those i think those were about i think all of the pairs were about 20 pounds each something like that but they're gonna be, all be linked in the description below anyway <sighs> fucking hell it's hot so hot the lights that i've got so i've got new lights for my filming setup and they are amazing but but they literally burn me. Like, they are so hot. It's like sitting by the sun, honestly. Right, so I'm going to quickly whiz through the Opoly stuff because, again, there was quite a lot of fails in the Opoly order that I did, which is a shame because I actually love Opoly. However, I find their sizing really, really weird. So usually in Opoly, I'm a size six and I always order the size six in the dresses because they really, like, cinch me in and, like, hug my waist and just make me look a little bit 
more slimmer and toned than I actually am. So the first thing that I picked up, and this is the only item from the whole um, order that I'm going to be keeping, this is this square necked, kind of like peachy pink uh, bodycon dress. It has these two sort of stitches down the front, and it is kind of like a long midi length. I absolutely love these really basic dresses for those nights out where they're kind of a little bit last minute, you don't really know what you want to wear, you haven't like tanned yourself and you haven't really got yourself fully ready, so you can just whack on something really, really plain and simple you can actually just wear a normal bra with this as well which I actually love because quite a lot of dresses that I own in my wardrobe you can't wear a bra with or you have to wear one of those stick on bras which just requires a lot more thought I mean not a lot more thought but in my brain it's a lot more thought so I would just much rather wear something that I can just wear a normal bra with and be done with it and yeah I really really like this style of dress and it does fit me really really well it hugs me in in all the right places and it feels a really nice kind of thick heavy material as well which I look for in a bodycon dress because I don't want my whole guts to be on show you know what I mean I want it to pull me in and just make me look nice and smooth so yeah I absolutely love that one I will be keeping that one there was two items though which I ordered which are beautiful and absolutely amazing but they just do not fit me like they are so so small they will be going back so the first one is this top and guys look how small this is look how small this is who is this fitting literally this would only fit baby like look Right, let me just show you because obviously I'm not gonna be able to try this one on like that is how <laughs> that is how far I can get this sleeve on my arm I literally like that that's as far as it's gonna go like this is tiny so obviously it's supposed to be one of these really cute like bando style tops where it's like a little bit ruched it's obviously this camel color it's a really beautiful style of top and I would have actually loved this if it fit me but it's just the tiniest thing that I've ever seen but so I am going to be returning this and swapping it for the size up because hopefully that will fit me better this was only five pounds though because it was in the outlet section from Opoly so um, I'm really hoping they still have the size eight because I really want this to fit me this is just so so small like I just wish that it was a little bit bigger it's just weird because some of the size 6 stuff really fits me very well and then the other stuff just doesn't and I just never know what to order so that's the only thing with Opoly but I really do like the quality of their stuff usually it's the best quality like if you want a nice dress Opoly is your gal literally so the last thing that I got from Opoly again is so beautiful but again it just does not fit me at all this is a really cute kind of this is kind of like black with like a little bit of like silver sparkle in it um it is this kind of like really like low plunge front with these spaghetti straps and it goes kind of like completely backless I'll put the picture of the model because obviously I can't try this on because it, it literally doesn't even go over my bum it's that small these looked amazing on the model but just on me this is way too small so this will be going back I'll probably just send this one back I probably won't try and get the size up just because I feel like it's a little bit too revealing the style for me anyway I don't really have the boobs for it so I feel like this one will just have to go straight back unfortunately but it is a beautiful dress and the last item guys if you're still here then why I'm joking obviously I still want you to be here the next item that I got I'm not sure and I'm gonna need your guys opinions on it so it's this red dress it's kind of like a wrap over style front with obviously quite a deep V and then it's got little sleeves and a kind of pleated skirt which goes down into kind of like a midi length and it does have a little belt to cinch you in I really like the way this looked on the model but when it came I just feel like it looks a little bit big and boxy on me and also it reminds me too much of like the Japanese style dresses which is not something that I don't like the look of but I don't know if I like it on me so yeah I'll try it on and you guys can tell me if you like it or not I was planning on wearing this to like a wedding this wouldn't be like an everyday or a holiday dress for me this would be like a sort of wedding outfit wedding guest outfit but I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not so let me know your opinions and how it's so hot it's so hot oh I'm literally I'm literally sweating I've actually broken out in a sweat and I have to go to work in like half an hour anyways right guys so that is everything that I have for my collective haul I know that was quite a long video and I felt like I haven't stopped talking for literally about two years but yeah I really really enjoy watching these types of videos on YouTube I hope you guys do too if you do then please let me know by giving this video a thumbs up so I can film more of them for you guys but yeah I hope you enjoyed it please subscribe if you haven't already that would be amazing thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video bye